Hello everyone, this is Chris Caligari and I am a member of the KubeVert community team. I would like to show you how easy it can be to migrate a Microsoft Windows guest virtual machine serving a web application to a guest virtual machine orchestrated by Kubernetes and KubeVert. For the sake of demonstration and everyone's time, I'm going to be using time compression in this video. The real-time mileage of commands will vary. I have a Kubernetes cluster pre-deployed along with KubeVert and CDI. The source is a Microsoft Windows 2019 server running Oracle VirtualBox and a Microsoft Windows 2019 guest virtual machine. Running inside of the guest is my favorite .NET application called Jellyfin, which is an open source media library. Go check them out over at jellyfin.org. I have the guest powered down and ready for a virtual disk transfer. The vert ctl command can now execute. Uploading a guest virtual disk can take a significant amount of time depending on disk size and network speed. And yay! Transfer is complete. Once the virtual disk upload is complete, the kubectl client command is used to create the virtual machine definition. The Kubernetes orchestrator takes just a few seconds to start the guest virtual machine. The virtual machine application port is then exposed by a Kubernetes node port type service. The virtctl command can then be used to establish a VNC connection to the virtual machine. From here, we can web browse to the host name and port and see the application. And opening up Firefox on my laptop shows the application is accessible on the general network. Thank you for watching my demo. If you would like to see specifics such as commands or manifests, feel free to read the blog post linked in the demo notes. Thanks.